welcome to Filipina Ajuma channel. So we're heading back to Seoul and I hope that you're enjoying our video so far. So please don't forget to subscribe. Before I show you the Dongmyo market or the Ukai Ukai market ala recto in Korea, please join us in our road trip to Seoul. And we have finally arrived at Dongmyo Flea Market. So this market is actually started in the late 1980s. So every day they are selling different types of items like wallets, electronics, old books, film, posters, or any vintage items. So you can actually have fun browsing and shopping without worrying about the cost. So definitely you can buy from maybe $2 above or maybe 40 peso above. So depends on what 
caught your interest. This market is also open from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. depends on the vendor. So as long as they can sell, they, I think they will be open. <laughs> and this place is actually located in Seoul next to Dongmyo Shrine. As you can see, you can buy some antiques, old electronics, um, anything. So just have to find some good quality product. Although those are already old, I think some of them are still um, very useful. So I actually asked Mr. Kim kung meron pa pa mga bumibili ng mga old items na to since hello mga 1970s pa yata yung mga uh, binibenta nila. So sabi niya, yes, meron pa daw. Especially yung mga um, directors or for example, magsushoot sila for like mga war movies. So usually yun yung mga ginagamit nila, di ba? So yung mga old equipment. So dito sila minsan bumibili ng mga items na yun. For example, this pipe and this old uh, suitcase. So, sino pa bang may bibli ng ganyan, right? Of course, you can also buy yung mga secondhand, the winter clothes, bag, na designer bags, I believe, or mga ano na class A siguro. So, yan, yan nila pinibenta yun. an interesting place kasi para kang bumalik sa 80s or 90s dahil sa mga vintage items na may kita mo. So talagang marireminence mo yung mga ginagamit mo ng mga bata ka pa. <laughs>
lang makita yung old typewriter and old computer. So, I remember when I was in grade 6, yun yung ginagamit ko pa dati. At saka yung telepono na yan. If you were born before 2000, definitely parang nagtutrowback ka sa mga nakikita mong items. Pero kung pinanganak ka after year 2000, um, this is also an interesting place kasi may malalaman at ma-re-realize ka kung ano yung mga ginagamit namin before. So, paghalata ng mga inta dito. Malaki po ang market na to. So, marami kayang malilibot at makikita. Pero since pagod na sila, kumain na tayo ng samgyopsal. Huwag na po kayo magtaka kung bakit tumataba ako pagkatapos ng trip namin sa Korea dahil ito ang mga pinapakain nila sa akin. So, I hope na nag-enjoy din po kayo and I hope na huwag niyo pong kalimutan mag-subscribe. Annyeong!